Here we go. First gear, second gear. Gonna say first. Gotta get that turbo boost. Here we go. Just follow the outside line. Kind of let me out of that there. Nice, one place gain. Hmm. Oh, still cuts off. Go wide. Oh, he's off the wider there. Let's go right. I'm sorry if I had anything to do with that, I'm sorry. Hello. Thank you, FPS. Very cool through that. Slightly getting held up a bit by Victor here. I think about move somewhere. Oh, Schumacher's gone. Car on your left. Dive on up the inside. There we go. Nice move, I think. Oh, and then understeer off the next corner. There we go. Needed to get past him. It's getting held up quite a lot there. Now these two are going to hold me up, I think, as well. I'm going to have to think about maybe doing some sends. Alrighty, enjoy your pie. about a move down there. Got like so much better exits than he does. And then say that and then do that. Want well, I need to get past these two. The gap's just gaining to Lars right now. I don't want to be stuck behind these two in traffic because I feel like going to be a bit too patient probably with the GTOs. Oh, there's one. I just leaves David now. Nice exit, come on. Let's me have it there. Nice. Right, now we can chase after the pack. Immediately goes sailing off of Druids. Right in between second and third there. It's annoying. Same as here. You're right in between gears. It's best just to leave it in third for the traction. Right, let's catch the pack.
That's my favourite corner on the circuit, that one. So satisfying to get right. I don't know what it's called, but... Better. Oh, a bit wide. You can use that runoff, though. You're slowly gaining. As long as you keep off that inside bit of that curb, you're all right. Where is he? Where is he? Oh my god! That was terrifying. This is a big old train up here. Guessing we found the GTOs. Yep, that's exactly what's happened. Oh, that poor GT. Left side. Still there. Clear. Right side, still there, hold your line, clear. Slow car ahead. Oh my god. Go right, left side. Go right. Clear on the left. This has all got very intense all of a sudden. This is intense, but fun. Love this car, love this series so much. Old school multi class is just the, the speed difference is ridiculous. Damn it, got coin third gear there. Could have been second. Can't make that. Tricky one, that one. Could have sent it, but it was a risky one. And luckily, we haven't lost too much time, so... Tried sending it, but realised I break too early. Tried backing out of it, but keeping my nose in a bit. Just a bit confusing for me. Oh well, we survive. Where are you going, GTO? I'll follow these guys through. Going on here. Car on your left. Clear. Car on the left. Oh, big pile up. Right. Oh, 
Clear. Quite a few incidents this race so far that we've had to avoid. One minute. Some of those gear. I'm not going to get either of these. Set out for the exit. Right side. Clear on the right. I love downforce so much. Oh, an old school downforce like this. Oh, that's a send. Now on your left. Clear. There we go. One minute thirteen point seven zero two. Traffic navigated. Some positions gained. We're now up to thirteenth place. Oh my god, you break early. Gonna need to clear Michael very quickly here. Damn it, understeered. Sorry, Doc, I didn't mean to pick up on you like that. Oh, understeer. Three car ahead. Go right. Well held, well held, Ator. Behind him again. Cheeky, cheeky. Love him out. One minute thirteen point six six one clear. Nice move. You got a slow car on the left. I think I'm running less downfalls than everyone. It's so much quicker on the straights. So much better punch out of the corners as well. Oh, Phillips had a moment. He's gone down from P5 down to what looks to be P10. Don't know if he's damaged or not, but we'll see. If we start suddenly catching, then we know he is. We are already a quarter of the way into this race. Got. Still got quite a while on the on the fuel, so
Yes, up to P11, nice. Yellows. Thank you. Sorry, Lau. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Got distracted looking at the incident up ahead there. Forgot to hit my breaking point. Laggy, laggy. And there we go. Traffic shenanigans all over again for round two. Last time traffic was quite kind, quite kind to us. We gained a few positions. Hopefully, that'll happen again. Get bullied. Oh, that's the grass. Don't break on grass on entry. Thank you for looking at your mirrors there. I kind of had no choice. Nice 10. We've gained a lot on Lars here. Nice. Come on. A lapsed GTP up ahead as well. And the rest of the uh, GTO pack. I can bouncing. Get held up here. Oh, that's a damage. That's a damage, Nissan. One minute Damn it. Half to the left there later. Right side. Clear. Stable on entry, not good. Couldn't get the front turned in how I wanted it to there. Gonna held up by Doug here as well, aren't we? Yeah, it was kind of me in the first round. Second round. A little bit frustrating. Clear. Oh got a little bit cross side with my gears there. Oh, P1 and GTOs at a moment. Down to P4 now. Oh, no, he's pitted, I think. You know what's happened there? Oh, beautiful. Don't mind if I just sneak on in, do you, GTO? Didn't think so. And then you open it up on the exit. Now you get to open my up on the exit. My big old engine. Those big old turbo. Oh, that's a bit hot. About the limit of the speed you can carry through there. Well, let's get Lars. Let's get Lars. God, I'm starting to sweat now. Ooh. One minute thirteen point two five eight. 
Are we locked up? Clear on the left. What do I like to do there? We have gained. Come on. We'll have him the I think we'll have him maybe Druid's next lap. Oh, that's too hot. Pushing it a bit too hard into there now. Dial it back a bit. Oh, I'm done. Maybe we're a bit far back. We carry so much more speed on the straights. Okay, whatever GTO, stick on the outside then. Cost us both time. Ah, uh, laps GTP, what are you going to do here? Cost me time is what you're going to do. Right, we've got to gain this back again now. Sorry, Mike. One minute, thirteen point five three three. Sorry, Carlos, get the downshift. Come here. Yeah, there's somewhere. That's your Sweaty. One Very sweaty. Five, five. I mean, I can get it in then. This could be the chance. Get a good exit out of here. He's going to be yeah, compromised. GT. Don't do that, Pablo. Terrifying.
Just off on the left and he drifts to the right is the most terrifying thing ever. However, that is... Well, it wasn't Pablo, sorry. It was... Oh, it was Diego in P6. Hmm. Damn it. Clear. With the time we gained. Getting it back though. Oh, we miss an apex by a country mile. Crappy. Too hard there. Bad Stay lap. Here, Brian. Come on. Back in the game. Sorry if I held you up at all. Not a problem. Now on your left. Clear on the left. Damn it. Go back to your racing line. Go back to your racing line, for Christ's sake. Calm it down, calm it down, calm it down. Over pushing now. Trying to make up for lost time. Never works. You end up crashing. Go into gear. My brain is as much of a puddle as I am right now. These guys behind. Now I have. All right. Thank you, man. Still got half an hour to go. We're just about halfway through. I can catch Pablo. I know it. Expect people to go back to their racing line. Apparently, they don't do that here. Guess we just have to go around them. Possibly Seamus as well. We'll see. Now I've just got to bang in some good laps. Now we've got a bit of clear air for a minute.
Oh, I am sweating hard. I'm here, Mr. Apex. Tricky one, that one. He thought I was going to send it around the outside, but I wasn't. I was just carrying so much speed, and I couldn't slow the car down. My, my God. Just a bit of a miscommunication between classes there. Hasn't lost us too much time, though, so we're all right. It's probably the closing speed on this car is so extreme that you can't really communicate where you want to go because you're trying to get through the corner and then worry about it on the exit but you come to them so quickly damn it thanks guys sorry about that I'm going to go left here Gotta be very decisive with your mod cars. Hello. One minute twelve point seven three five. Testing those guys in all the wrong places, Jamie. Comes the fucking GTOs again. Catching these guys in the wrong places, Jamie. Car on your left. Clear on the left. Can't catch Pablo. Every time I gain time, I just lose it straight away. Not giving up, though. Push into the end. We got 12 laps until we pit. Thank you, Ryan. One minute and 14 point really hoping that fuel calculator so is in kilograms. You got a slow car on the right. You got a slow car That's on a lapped the right. car. Oh my god, turn. Oh, my right hand is literally like death gripping the wheel. I'm going to move on. That was terrifying. Let me have this here, please. Seamus is pitting, okay. Oh god, missed my shift to that, but I was in fourth. I don't know if this fuel calculator is in kilograms or not. I haven't got... There's no chance around this track to look, it's too bloody busy. saying though refuel with 40 
Don't know if that's going to be enough. What are we saying? I've got 20 laps to go, 10 laps of fuel I need. Which is 23 and a half kilos is 10 laps. There's 10, there's 20 laps to go, so I'll be hitting, be hitting on lap 40. So we need 11 laps. I'm going to say 30 kilos. Very safe. That should do us. 30 kilos. I've used eight of my nine lives. Maybe a bit extra. 32. Yeah, that was Even that guy at the start said 61 and 61. And I went 90, yeah, so that. I, I that would mean 32, yeah, story. 32 kilos it is. Still don't know if I take tires or not. Did you manage to keep it on track? Barely. Ooh, sorry about it. I'm sorry. Car on your left. Still there. Oh my god. Clear. Drive your normal line, I'll get past you. So what the fuck, man? Come on. It's frustrating me now. Is that the fucking lap GTP? Started going left thing, didn't go left. Thank you. Oh, Shizen. Shizen! Woo! Mitchell, I see you there. Hello. Oh, really? That's cool. Craig, uh, is that just Craig chatting shit? Or is that actual good, good chat? You know, I'm sweating like crazy. Well, I aim to put on a good show, and I feel like I'm doing that. Out of quite a few sends I've had to do, and it's been hella fun. That's not the racing line into the corner, GTO. You don't enter the corner on the right. I, the only thing I am unsure about is do I take tyres or not? But when I was doing Nords, I think I took tyres. So last time I did one of these pit stop races. 
but I can't remember. I can't remember if they get done during the fuel stop. Or if they get done afterwards. If they get done during, then we'll just take them. I've got them ticked. If they don't, I'll untick them. I'll have it all ready to go. Oh my god, this... Just cars everywhere. That was the car that was leading in GTO. Juco. He's had not a great time of it then. Come on, 20 minutes to go. Five laps till we pit. That's not the line, GTO. Time to park the team. Turn, 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 turn. Fly. One minute eleven point eight four three. Thank you, Kurt. Thanks, Kurt. GTs and all the wrong fucking places right now. Every IMS a race ever. There's the fuel light. Not long before we yeet ourselves into the pits. Thank you. Yep. Gonna go 33 kilograms of fuel. I think that's extra safe, but we'll see. Just pray we don't run out, basically. Jack is in the pits. 
2.4 laps of fuel. Oh shit, 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 shit! Split my brain power right now into fuel and driving. The lead is fitting now. You have two laps of fuel left. Name. Didn't work there through T1. The lead is fitting now. The lead is fitting now. Oh, Aldi. Car on your left. Clear on the left. The lead is fitting oh, yeah. now. Uh, Mitchell, if you're still here. Uh, if you're still here and watching the broadcast, are anyone is anyone taking tyres? Any GTPs, are they taking tyres? Can you see on the broadcast? Everyone is taking tyres, perfect. Have it, mate, have it. You could, I can't tell if you're trying to get by or if you're happy there. Oh, I'm happy here. I don't have a All break right. line speed. Clear. Yep. Okay. So one litre, one litre, one lap is two and a half kilograms. And we'll have ten laps to go, so 25, yeah, 33 will easily be enough. Okay, you give me that inside then. Clear. Right. Box, box, box. Breathe. And breathe. And breathe. Okay, punch it. Really hope that wasn't a speeding penalty. One minute forty seven. Point five two eight. Nope, we got away with it. Right, Seamus got past Pablo. Uh, sorry, Pablo got past Seamus. Or tyres. Yeah, realised that one. The brakes just didn't work into the first into Druids there. Or there. Right, we've got 10 laps to catch Seamus. I'm going to have to be a second a lap faster. Oh, tires, come on, heat up. Car's grippy, but on cold tyres, it's a tricky balance just until they heat up. Right, it's be a second a lap faster than the Seamus here. And have good luck in traffic. One minute, fifteen point one one six. You got a slow car on the right. Sorry about that. Clear. Oh, a bit of clear air for the moment. Do 
pretty fast for me. David, use your common sense here. Thank you, David. Gaining on Seamus, we're gaining. Was that a bad time there? Fucking bumps, curbs, whatever they're called. Uh, stutters, can you not? I don't know, four screen mini screen freezes there. Well, concern. Leader of both classes crashed. Oh. Seamus has been hella held up here. Look at that gains. I'm having you in the first corner, mate. One minute ten point four seven seven. The worst one, you can't quite get the run to send it up the inside there, our druids. Oh, okay. I thought you meant like crushed out. Come on. Coming for you, Seamus. I'm coming for you. I like your livery, mate, though. Rate that. Last pass, last pass, 35. Good boy.
Jeez, there's so much traffic. Oh my god, what are you doing? Left side. Stay on the right. Daniel, don't do this. Good. Oh, he like properly. Well, I wonder where he went there. I didn't want the race decided like that. Gonna go for it, go for it, man. Don't loiter around behind him. Clear on the right. One minute fourteen point eight two zero. Oh my god! Clear. I didn't mean to do that. Locked up. Whoops. Good avoidance from Seamus there. That was not meant to be a lunge. I think Seamus is running quite low downforce like me. Maybe a little bit more, though. Right side, clear on the right. I'm at one minute eleven point six nine. My small tire mark there. Thank you, sir. Whoa! Come on, car. Two laps to go or white flag? Two to go. Bear on the brakes into Druid. I need to be on his ass coming out of Paddock. Way over fueled. That's all right. This is going to be white flag. Way flag. too far back.
unless these GTOs have anything to say about it. Congrats, Javier, Robert, Ian, excellent podium. Good race, guys, that was fun. A good race, Scott. Yeah, that was a blast. That was some oh great time, my god, I... Jamie, that was a lot of fun. <laughs> and just kept getting those GTPs in the wrong spot every time. I kept seeing them creeping up closer. <laughs> he had more tire left at the end down in my air gun. Fuck me. I take tires if it's up. Seamus, that was a brilliant race, man. Pushing me all the way. Thank you. I was worried traffic was going to screw me over in the last few laps, but I held it on. Great race. Oh my god. Pit box in three, two, one. I am right here. shattered. We're done. Get going. I am shattered after that. Welcome back to Brands Hatch. Our fourth round of the Camel GT series was action packed out there today, but it was Xavier Sanchez who won it from the pole. However, it was certainly not an easy one for him. It came down to less than two. Also, thank you, uh, Nick. For the follow, by the way, if you're still here, I did not even notice that 11 minutes ago. Close to the latter half of the race just seemed to have slowed him up enough. Jack Wells, though, Gav. Right. Xavier won it by one and a half tenths. One and a half tenths in it at the end there. Jack Wells. And Jack Wells only six tenths ahead of Pablo at the end. And obviously we finished only half a second off of Seamus. Um, we started 22nd on the grid and finished sixth. Wow, that was fun. Intense, yes. Terrifying, yes. But fun, hell yes. Oh my god. Oh, I'm actually dead after that. Like, you have no idea how... much oh that's so sticky <laughs> oh 
Wow. Right, let's have a watch back at the start, shall we? Because we didn't actually have that... Well, we had a good first lap. We gained a place, and then we just sort of got a bit stuck. And then we had a lot of carnage to avoid in the opening laps. Let's have a watch back at the start. We just sent one up the inside there. I, I, made, I made a couple of really good dives on that race, if I do say so myself. Um, go on. And then, yeah. We just sort of avoided the carnage on the opening laps. Um, this was what this was the dive I was really happy with. Turn that down, that's very loud. Just sent one in from here. I was like, yes, give me the place. I was just getting my pair of pair of netballs out and just just going at it. Where was the first wreck we had to avoid? Oh, it was here. That was a really good send. Just into the first corner. Just went, thank you very much. Give me that. Like, I was not... I was trying just not to get held up. And then the traffic really played in our favour in the opening half of the race. Or the opening... Uh, stint through the traffic anyway. What happened here? Oh, that was Ator. We ended up having a battle with him earlier. Oh, we just got... Whoa! Oh, he got iRacing physics moment. That's um, an odd one, that one. And then the Audi is just like... Hello. <laughs> and then we got stuck in this pack. And then just from here, I was just like, yes, I, any move, I, I'm going for it. I don't know what that Audi was doing there. Made two places up there, but lost the position to Ator trying to avoid it. Get my ass in for an interview. Uh, Sure. Um, which Discord? Uh, which, which, which Discord? Camel Discord? No? I'm, I'm not in the Discord, Craig. I'm not in the Discord. Uh, where's GSLC? Where is it? There it is. Discord link, surely. Discord, there we go. Join. Where, where am I going, Craig? Where am I, where am I going? I'm oh, ready for interview. King, it's Andy Medell. Hello yeah. there. Andrew, congratulations Thank on... Thank you very much. It really was a really great drive. I mean, first of all, let's talk through the qualifying. You kind of had two bad qualifying laps, I see. Uh, yeah, the first one, I uh, spun off and hit the wall and then um, got a, uh, an off track, uh, I think on the second lap or something. It was so long ago, I can't remember now. So, uh, yeah, ended up having to start at the back. Now... I, I know Andrew from multi class racing, so he is very well skilled at the multi class racing. So starting at the back would probably be something that would help. What was the what was the drive to survive here? Were you were you hunting down or were you just saying to yourself, let's just take the slow and let's just hope for the best? Uh well in the opening laps I was just trying to get as many positions as possible. Any opportunity I had for a send, I made a couple of uh 
launches from quite far back into uh, Druids and uh, used the traffic to the advantage in the opening uh, run through through the GTOs. And uh, I think I managed to get up to about uh, 12, 11th or 12th place by the end of the first round of traffic. Talk us through the traffic, because tra traffic on any track is tough. Brands Hatch is a very narrow track. So talk us through that traffic, especially because we know there are a few corners that are no-nos. Uh, it's with the GTOs is tricky because you get so much of a better launch out of the corner, but it's it's still hard to get that send because they just understeer so much. So you've got to be very careful where you put the car, but as long as you're decisive and pick your points and make yourself known that you're going to make the move, generally it all comes off cross, cross quite clean. Now, you weren't here last week because you were in France, so you've only had two races this season. Next week, we're at Sebring. What are we going to look from you from that? Because I think so. A little bird told me that might be one of your favorite tracks. It is, yeah. I'm, uh, Sebring's definitely one of my uh, stronger tracks on the service, so uh, definitely looking forward to uh, getting into the race next weekend and uh, seeing what we can do there. Andrew, it was a fantastic drive up the field, starting 20, oh, sorry, starting 22nd, making 16 places up, finishing in sixth. I hope you have a good evening and a good rest of your weekend. We look forward to seeing you once again at Sebring in the series. But until then, have a good weekend. Thank you very much. Oh, damn. Oh, that was cool. Oh, Jesus Christ. Eh. Well, that was cool. First time I've ever had an interview on a broadcast. Damn, that was, uh, that was, that was good. I like it. I like that. I should do, I should do better results more often in broadcast splits. <laughs> But uh, anyway, that was so good. So, so good. I love this series. I love this car. I love this. This track is amazing. Slicing through the traffic, the manual gearbox, the, just the car on the edge the whole time for a whole hour. It's a proper adrenaline rush. This is what racing should, should be. A car that's just on the limit and... Uh, to have it in a series where the racing is, for the most part, clean, and that push on the last 10 laps after we came out the pits to catch Seamus, I'm not even annoyed I didn't catch him. He fully deserved that, that fifth place there. Um, he just didn't make a mistake. Traffic was a bit of a bugger to both of us there, but I think on pure pace we could have had him, but to finish that high up in... Given the fact I went into this race with 15 minutes practice, is um, it's a miracle I finished. But to make 16 places up is... And it's 16 places on pace as well. I made a lot of overtakes, not just avoiding the carnage and then finishing halfway off the pack. That was pace. As, as Craig said, Sebring next week should be fun. Um, I'm strong at Sebring. It's definitely a track I know very well and I'm very quick at. So, uh, yeah. Broadcast split again next weekend, I believe. Yes, next Saturday. I don't think I'm doing anything next Saturday. But anyway, yeah, we'll be doing the broadcast split again next Saturday. I'm going to head off, have a massive shower now. And, um, yeah, I will see you all in the next one. We might, we might have another go at Grand Prix Tour tomorrow. I want to finish a race. We might do. I'll see how it is. If not, we might do some ESS tomorrow and uh, head over to Le Mans. So whatever happens, I will probably be streaming tomorrow night. I'm going to head off and I will see you all in the next one. See you later, guys.